Lift up my eyes to the hills from whence come my help. My help comes from the Lord, the Lord that made heaven and earth. He said, He will not suffer thy foot, thy foot to be moved. The Lord that keepeth thee. He will not slumber nor sleep. Oh, the Lord is thy keeper. The Lord is thy shape upon thy right hand. Upon thy right hand. No, the sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon. Shall preserve thy soul even forevermore. Oh, my help, my help, my help, and I will. To the hills from whence cometh my help. My help comes from the Lord, the Lord that made heaven and earth. He said, He will not suffer thy foot, thy foot to be moved. The Lord that keepeth thee, He will not slumber. Nor sleep. Oh, the Lord is thy keeper. The Lord is the shade upon thy right hand. Upon thy right hand. No, the sun shall not light thee by day. No, the moon by night. He shall preserve the soul, even forevermore. My hell, my hell, my hell, and I will. Thank you for your grace, your mercy, and your love.
thank you, Lord, that your word is true. That every promise in your word is yes and amen. Oh, my God. Now the sun shall not smite thee by day, nor the moon by night. You are my strong tower, my help in time of need, that's who you are. All of my help comes from the Lord. Yes, it is today and forever. All of my help, my help, that I will not Praise the Lord. Malachi 1.11 says, From the rising of the sun to the going down of the same, the Lord's name is to be praised. Psalm 113 verse 3 says, From the rising of the sun to the going down of the same, the Lord's name is to be what? Praised. And we've started from the place of the rising of the sun on the east side of New York City. And I thank God that there are people. Many are called, but few are chosen. And out of the chosen, a few are still are faithful. And I thank God that you are amongst the faithful ones who will come out to raise an altar. If God would have spared Sodom and Gomorrah for ten people, he will spare New York City for your sake. Amen. For our people have taken time out to just come and praise God and worship his majesty. He will save our land. He will save our nation. He will save the world. Why? Because he has a people. Blessed be God forevermore. He is the king of kings. The lord of lords. He's our own Emmanuel. Ever present God. And that's why they call him. Even as we close, I want to encourage you. Fill out your envelopes. If you have an offering, give it to the ushers as you're leaving. And um, they will take it from you. And that's how we can let you know what we're doing in Lilies. I also want to say you've been given bracelets that say worship is majesty. The purple bracelet. Uh, uh, yeah. Is it bracelets they call it? Yes. I think I'm right. Good. Okay. So you've been given that. The whole point is that you wouldn't need... A lot of people who didn't come during the week will show up over the weekend and act like they've been here all week. Praise the Lord. <laughs> so if you have that bracelet, you get priority entry. Amen? Amen. Praise the Lord. And so if you are in the house tonight and you haven't received your, your bracelet, you need to get one. <laughs> But what I'm saying is, if we have that, you can go in. The rest of them will have to just wait until those who've been faithful. Everybody's called, but few are chosen. Yes. And out of the chosen, a few are what? Faithful. God bless you. And as they call the king of kings, in a culture I know, they call him Igwe. So we're going to just have Igwe. So let's go with that. <laughs> Thank you. 
God and so may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. For surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever and when you get done with all the forever say Amen. God bless you.